Hey guys, Trevor Cruz Lima today with and we're back with Evangelion episode 10. So far, the series has been impressing me the last few episodes. I've loved the last three, I think. I think the last three have been uh, pretty decent. And we got to know a lot more about Asuka last episode. It was pretty interesting to see the character. I enjoyed her. I think like, she's potentially one of my favourite characters if she keeps the way she is. Definitely very prideful, but seeing them work together and the uniqueness of last episode was pretty fun. Uh, cause even they had fun and making last episode, and I thought it was an interesting take um, on teamwork. Uh, she definitely took a pride hit off Ray, Ray which uh, motivated her to work harder. And she, she said, oh, she's dead passionate about what she does, and she doesn't lie about down. Which was all interesting stuff, and I'm glad they uh, touched upon it and looked like Sinji had grown. I think she's good growth for Sinji as well as he seemed to grow a lot last episode as well. But some things didn't change as at the end they still argued like that like they were at the start of the episode but something but something did change in like the teamwork and just like putting up each other and learning each other's traits. So I think living together paid off. I'm curious if it's gonna still live together and how much screen time she's gonna get because if she just gets quite a bit because I do I'm enjoying the character so far. And I'm curious what the series is gonna take as now, as last episode was definitely a fun one. So anyway, to find out, is to check it out. So please like and subscribe if you enjoy. And do other series like JoJo's Death Parade and the Winter Season Anime. So feel free to check them out as well. <laughs> do wonder if out of the three kids we've got, I wonder which one's going to die first if they do have a death. <laughs> Why does everyone love this guy? He's coming this suave or something. Is it a beach episode, guys? Wrecked. I don't think Sinchi cares about going on a school trip. <laughs> it's like fair play. It's not argumentative. We did that nicely. <laughs> so simple. Don't mess with me, so <laughs> she ruined you. Evil. Oh, they're not actually going. That's pretty sad. No, my beach episode dreams are over, guys. I love the way she stands so proud. Makes sense that they can't go, though. Not arguing it. <laughs> they really just, really just give a shit. Sinji hanging out with all the ladies. We were trying to make um, Sinji rebel. Now oh, she got to wear screen suit. That's all she wanted. Our Lord Sinji is a sitting a pervert. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know why he's not moved his eyes once. This guy. So she's actually quite smart then, fair play. Yes, science, bitch. <laughs> Sinji's not easily seduced, look at him. He's a brave warrior. Oh, I can't help himself though. I love that Sinji's a little pervert. He's a grown boy. <laughs> I can fucking voice that to Back home, I'm in tree. Fucking hell. That was an intense shot. Oh, what's hiding in the volcano? I suppose the ages don't just cause massive disasters, because that way we wouldn't just win. Well, did they want the planet for something like? Couldn't they? Uh, the angels could easily destroy the planet. I wonder what their aim is and what they actually want. Ooh, what's in there? Ooh, is the angel being born in there? It's like it was in an egg. Ooh, is it something they could actually prove and like do like do science stuff on? 
Ooh, I'm guessing last time they went there, I just got destroyed. Oh yeah, I thought it'd be a live angel sample. <laughs> Do it, it's important. And it's calm. You risk your whole squad for those samples. <laughs> yeah, that's what's inside the Evons. It's got to be because they look they look similar when it's got his face mass destroyed. Shouldn't have fucking passion. She's ready. Way too confident. <laughs> Going to a bit in, isn't she? If I ask her to get one up on her, I love it when it does that. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> How the fuck did they get it in that? <laughs> it didn't look as cool. Oh, you can't do it now. <laughs> Why did she care about TV so much? Ooh, playing. Well, this is what demotivates her. <laughs> Instantly, yeah. <laughs> that was easy motivation, weren't it? <laughs> Just re knew what way what knew what she was doing. Re knew what she was doing. Re, I can't. I've can't figure out any pronunciation. Re or Ray? Mm. It's very dramatic. Why is it if they fail this, the world's over? I don't understand. I guess they're not at home based on some angels show up, they ruin them. They're all quite vulnerable as well, I guess, all the stuff. Oh, okay, that's why then. Fair play? Alright, that makes more sense. Oh, that's a face protected though. I would shit myself going into fucking lava. She's pretty calm, give her that. Oh god. That's the, uh, that every crack would slowly get to you. God, that pressure. Well, to be fair, like, if the supports break, how does she get up? The Toto will put her at risk. I thought there's an angel survived down here. One chance. I don't know why I think she's always so desperate like that. Oh, it's massive, isn't it? Oh, they got it. Now get the fuck up. No, not yet. Something's going to happen. It's too easy. Bring her up. Okay. Oh, they actually did it. Something's going to happen. What's in that fucking lava? What happens in the second impact? Oh, no. Yeah, so you knew something's going to happen. The angel's not happy about being taken. Talk about merging at the wrong moment. How the fuck does that survive in the lava? Ah, oh, that's fucking annoying. Yes, Sinji, throw that knife in. <laughs> Grab the knife. You know how to make it intense. Yes. Wait. 
fucking hell. Oh no, it goes through the suit, that's bad. Black Snake. Oh, this isn't good. Yes. Oh, resilient to it, shit. Fucking quick thinking there. Love that Sinji and her both. They're in sync still, I like it. That was cool. They think so alike. Ooh, before it went down there, it damaged those cables, shit. That was a good job, but... Oh, the pressure's going to it. Oh shit, how are we getting her out? Fuck! Hey, that nah, should be fine, but how's they going to get her? Did he go in? Did my boy Sinji just save her ass? How come Sinji's robot can survive the pressure? Oh, Sinji, our boy, coming in, quit thinking, I like it. Oh, I'm liking this Sinji, he's, he, he's a lot of guy. Fucking hell, that was close. I knew they probably won't kill her on that early on, but fuck it up. I was like, what are they going to do to get her now? My boy won the hot spring as well. This fucking bird. I don't understand why would you want to go to a hot spring after being in lava? He wants to go to that side. Do it. Just go over. Do it for us. Do it for the audience. We need to see Misa. As she's of age. Oh, he's all a big boner. This guy. No one's watching you. Ooh, what's that scar? I want to know what happened in the second impact. Give us a flashback. God damn it. Oh, they've hinted at the past and I need to know more. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> the show's got me curious now. Do it, man. I'm a sucker for when shows do that when they give you like information about the past and you just want to know more about the second impact. Like, uh, I think someone commented before that like, underwater city that there is was from the second impact, so something may happen there. It's like if a comet hit a country, it's like seen army took it out, so I'm curious what the second impact actually does. Um, my boy Sinji coming in with the clutch save for uh, Asuka, which was pretty neat. I respect Sinji for doing that. Asuka did the job with that situation pretty well. She was dead calm. And, like, I like how the end she didn't like just panic or like cry or anything. She just accepted like because she was dead. Like she's just sad about like she just succeeded and now we have to go for the shit for her. Like I like how they both came on the same plan and then Sinji just came straight down. Like pretty quick reaction time to that. Um, yeah, no, 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 like I said, I like the moment when she was like she thought she was gonna die. She was like super calm about it. Like, yeah. So she's gained a bit of respect for Sinji as well for saving her, like, saving her ass, which was pretty neat. Uh, it's a shame we didn't get hold of the egg specimen. It would have been like be cool to see what they would have done like, with a, a sample if they got one. And then that order was pretty interesting. Like, I think I was going to see if I could find it. Like, that specific order happens if they failed. Wow, is that going to be like a super power? Like, I'm guessing, right, so I'm guessing is the last egg sample they got, it turned into a really powerful being and it just destroyed everything. So I'm guessing that one got away because it died because of her quick thinking. I'm guessing if it grew to full adulthood, it would have been quite destructive because they was going to nape on that whole area and kill them all if they failed. So I'm not too sure what happened there, why it was so important if they failed, the world was going to end. So I'm guessing is it right because it was such a strong sample. I guess we're going to go find out when we learn more about the second impact. So yeah, overall, very interesting episode. I enjoyed it. 
and I could keep the show keeps getting better and better. Like every episode has, has improved on itself so far, like, and I'm enjoying it. And I like, like, I like someone pointed out in the comments as, as well, like the fact that they always try and kill the angels in interesting ways, not just to do it super simply. But other than that, thanks for watching. I'll see you next week. Peace.